In my high school physical science class today, students created a collaborative study guide for our electricity and magnetism unit using the PowerPoint feature of Office 365. Representatives from Microsoft joined us as we explored these new technology tools for the first time. Right. I like the facts about voltage and resistance. It was well in depth and taught me a lot. Students were highly engaged in the process and quickly realized that when it comes to learning, 30 brains are better than one. Having students collaborate and communicate to create takes my teaching and their learning to much higher levels of thinking. Okay, so now I have the interaction that's with proper. Good. And then I found the friction with the Okay, good. I like how not only would I have to know all the information, but my student friends they might know more about one topic like voltage or resistance than I would and they can make that slide based on their information and I can make the slide that I'm good at based on my information. Using Microsoft in our class for the first time was a great opportunity um, especially you, having a Microsoft representative with us it was kinda cool because it was the first time we had used that Microsoft office and we had a representative there to witness us using it for the first time in real world and how we could use it in our class. It was so fantastic this morning to be in a vibrant classroom to watch students collaborating on learning the electromagnetic fields in science using PowerPoint to be able to describe what they learned, to be able to put picture annotations on what they learned and then collaborate with one another and comment on one another's work so the entire classroom was learning going forward. Yes. So whenever you make a comment, I need you to put your initials next to it so that we know um, who's making the comment. Think about things like, if you see incorrect information, can you fix that information? Office 365 made the collaboration more efficient and engaging. Students could work simultaneously with the entire class, not just the students at their table. This is Lee Michelonis for Cobb Ed TV.